School is back in session across Buford County. At WSAD's Joseph Leonard spoke with the superintendent and a middle school principal today. He is joining us now with what they expect this year. Buford County teachers welcome students back today, but before the students cracked open their textbooks, there was a lot of preparation from the district. With pencils in hands and books being read, classrooms are back open in Beaufort County. Superintendent Frank Rodriguez says there's nothing like the first day of school. Our teachers were excited to meet our kids. Our administrators were excited to get our kids in the building. Uh, so there's nothing like the energy of a first day of school. Rodriguez spent his day visiting schools across the district. He says he started his day with school bus drivers to make sure the students were getting to class safely. He says safety is a high priority for them. This summer, staff train with first responders to make sure they can keep your kids safe. Safety is a high priority for, for us all the time. Uh, and, and so we work on it. We've had different drills and training sessions with the Sheriff's Department, with other local municipalities in Bluffton and Buford and Port Royal, all in preparation to make sure that we're doing everything we can to keep our students safe here in Buford County. Bluffton Middle School Principal Matthew Hall is excited to have a teacher in every classroom. Starting the year out um, with a teacher in every single space uh, is at this, at this point in in the, the climate of, of public education, um, you don't find that everywhere. So, so we are feeling very, very lucky to uh, have that here at Bluffton Middle. The school is finally finished with upgrades included in the $50 million 2019 referendum. From freshly painted walls to new technology and upgraded security, Hall says the school feels brand new. The building is looking better than it really ever has, and, and we're just excited to welcome the largest 6th uh, through 8th grade class at Bluffton Middle School is uh, ever had. Robert Small's Leadership Academy is the newest school to join the district that was also included in the referendum from 2019. And this year, voters will decide on the school district's biggest referendum yet. Joseph Leonard, WSAV News 3, on your side.